It was a doozy. The cliffhanger, I think, did something really different that we hadn't done before. We had one of our big accidents and end of season moments um, in water, which I think was uh, took us into a whole other place. Um, it reminded me of when I used to watch emergency shows when I was a kid. Water was always involved. But um, it, what it did this time is it gave everybody that kind of claustrophobic feel and they were holding their breath even though they didn't know they were holding their breath while watching it and that was what was great about ending the season the way it did. And we are going to pick up this season with all of squad with no air. <laughs> so that's a great place to start the season. Um, and I think it will be as exciting uh, at the beginning of season 10 and they're going to start watching this show and hold their breath immediately. So that's, uh, I know what's coming. I'm not going to tell you guys what's coming, but it's very exciting and I'm, I'm really happy to be doing season 10. The changes that are coming were actually alluded to at the end of season nine. And at the end of season nine, um, I said to Captain Casey, he was like, well, well, what is it? And I was like, I don't know yet. And uh, we started season 10 and I still don't know. No, that's not true. Um, <laughs> it's going to be drastic for everybody. The whole house will be affected. Uh, and that's the, the best way I can put it We're, without giving too much away. There will be complete upheaval of what everybody thinks they know about Firehouse 51.